go outside, it feels so good We're loving and hating and making scenes Now we just see everything we believe We just see everything So today is a tutorial on the eye look that I'm wearing. It is a smoky purple eye with gloss on the lid as well as glitter and gold mixed in. Let's get started. I've already done my primer, foundation, contour, brows. I'm in the middle of filming a review on the Wonder Brow. So if you're interested in that, that should already be up on my channel. Today I'm going to be using my Natasha Denona 5 Pan Palette in number 10. Of gorgeous shades. I will be using this shade first with my number 27 Sephora brush. And I've already primed my eyes. Top this onto the crease. Like I said, I've done my face base already to save time, but honestly, probably should have done that after my eye look. Mm, we may have some fallout. Hopefully not too much. Taking more of that shade underneath the lower lash line. Now with a flat brush, I'm taking that same shade and patting that all over the lid. Going back to my 27 and blending that out. Going into the middle matte shade. I'm going to pat that on the lid but keeping it kind of low. I want it to fade. Once again, blend. I'm going to take a little bit of this guy. I'm going to lightly use that as a transition shade after the fact. So right along the edges, just very light amount of pressure. With my pencil brush, going into that middle shade, focusing that right on the outer third of the lower lash line. And smudging that along the upper lash line. Now for the gloss. This is what I'm going to be using. This is the Sephora Pro Dimensional Highlighting Palette in Cool. I have a whole review on this. If you're interested, I'm going to be taking Chromosphere, the silvery looking one, although they all kind of look the same, so it really doesn't matter. I'm going to be taking this and mixing it with the purple shade that's shimmery, and we're going to top off the lid. Digging into this. And I'm putting that on the back of my hand to mix the two. Taking this, and I mix those two together, and it creates a slippery sheer glass. I'm going to tap that right at the center.
Now, of course, we have to use this gold because how gorgeous is that? I'm going to take a small, clean brush, put that right in the inner corner. This can have a little fallout, so I'm tapping off the excess. I'm just going to pat, pat, pat. I love this undone eye effect. The gloss settles into the creases of the eyes, but that just like adds to it. It looks so messy and galactic. Before I put on mascara, I'm going to take my Lavender Cosmetics Glitter. This is from, I forget what brand. I'm just going to take a tiny bit on my finger and pat. They're kind of chunky, multicolored glitter. Now with that same brush we used for the gold, I'm going back into it. Again, tapping off the excess. I'm going to pat this right at the center of the under eye. I'm taking my YSL The Shock Mascara. I'm going to do a coat of this. I'm taking my Muru Muru Butter Blush in Plum Rose from Physicians Formula. And then for highlighter, I'm taking out my Anastasia Beverly Hills Aurora Glow Kit and I'm going to use Helia which is my favorite shade. My gosh, this stuff is so pretty. It's beautiful golden green. This whole look is a little extra, so of course I'm going to put a little on my nose. For lips, I'm taking out one of my favorite nudes. It's the NARS Audacious Raquel. But before that, I'm using my Wet n Wild Bear to Comet lip liner. Can you hear Chunker snoring? <laughs> That's my dog. He loves our new couch. We have this fancy new like reclining couch. He loves it. So I'm taking a little bit of this that right underneath the brow. Alright, final step is a spritz of spray. Taking my go-to as of recently. This is the Milani Make It Dewy. Alright, so that is the final look. I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, thumbs up, comment, Subscribe if you haven't done so already. Press that bell next to the subscribe button to get all notifications from me. And I will catch you in my next one. Bye, loves.